Hey loves, it's officially day four and I am excited about this day. So the prompt was hand and while I'm not good at drawing hands whatsoever, I decided to draw this hand holding a snake and I've actually done this before. I had drawn this digitally a couple, I don't know when, like last year and I actually made stickers um, and had them in my shop for a while. Um, but that's not really my style anymore, so they're not in my shop anymore. But I decided to redraw it in this new style that I'm doing that I absolutely love. <laughs> and I took so much time. This one so far has taken me the longest because I really tried to be planful and mindful about my sketch underneath and really think about how the snake is looking and I don't know <laughs> a lot about anatomy which you'll definitely see the hand is definitely not perfect I don't really draw people often and hands like never I think I've drawn hands when I once when I did that sketch and it um that one sticker and it took me so long and then I had like a few sketches in my sketchbook when I was like I'm gonna practice anatomy and it yeah I fail <laughs> so the hand is not perfect but you know what we're gonna go with it the thumb is definitely too small I think this thumb needs to be a little bit bigger and the fingers should have been a little bit further apart but I started doing it a little bit off to the side a little bit too much so that's why I couldn't space out the fingers enough but I think this came out pretty cool and I really like it I want to redraw this a little bit bigger and with more time because I was trying not to spend forever on each piece you know and I only have certain amount of time to do it and you know film a video and get it out for you guys every day it's a lot a lot of work so I tried to keep it down but this one still took me like over an hour to do and so far the other ones have been like 30 minutes so this was my longest one that I worked on and I worked really hard I was super in the zone I don't think I was successful in the hand like the lines and the details that I did on the hand I think I put too much in there I tend to go overboard which I am learning through this process um, you would have thought that you know I learned when I did the cloud that I need to be more mindful about my lines and then I went into this day not very mindful about my lines <laughs> um, so I'm definitely learning a lot but I really do like how it turned out I try to keep the snake simple I didn't do any of it's like normally you do like kind of the more detailed with like to show the scales and stuff and I didn't do that I kept it simple just drew some details and you can tell that I wasn't paying attention to my hand because my hands blocking a lot of these shots so I'm sorry about that but I'm really happy with it I'm feeling super inspired to make this into a full piece and it came out really nice so I think if I spend more time I could really work on making sure the anatomy of the hand is a little bit better and the snake and the way the snake is moving makes a little bit more sense but let me know what you think of it down in the comments and let me know what you did for today what, what your prompt was or if you had ha hand to what it looked like I want to hear all about it and I'll see you tomorrow mm -hmm.